what's up guys this is Wicked Android HD and today I'm gonna to be showing you how to flash CR Droid latest version for Samsung Galaxy S for i9505 so first of all we need to wipe and format clean to install new ROM and um, yeah that's the most common procedure I recommend before flashing any kind of ROM because a clean install of a ROM is a better option in order to see all the features of, the, of that ROM without any kind of problems. A uh, couple of uh, minutes before I have tried the I tried the AICP ROM Android Eyes called Project ROM and uh, which seemed to be seemed to be more customizable than the Remix Resurrection ROM, but uh, yeah, um, there was some performance uh, drawbacks. Okay, so after you've uh, wiped the data, what you have to do is to go and uh, install CR Droid, as you may see here, and then we'll have to flash gaps. And then if uh, the stock kernel which comes with this ROM uh, has some lags, some problems, you, we will test the Google Max kernel. So we're gonna go and flash the gaps. Okay, where are the gaps? Where are the gaps? Where are the gaps? Where are the gaps at? <laughs> okay. My neighbors are getting on my nerves. I don't know what's happening up there, but it's kind of late and children children may sleep at this hour. <laughs> okay, fixed in permissions and context. And we're ready to go. So we're gonna reboot and uh, I'm gonna show you the boot animation. Okay, let me focus properly. So Samsung Galaxy S4. Jesus. Sorry guys again for the background noise. It was more pleasant if they were fucking. Okay, CR Droid, CR Droid minimalistic animation looks well. I like minimalistic ROMs. Okay, guys, so I'm gonna get back to you guys after you after it boots up. It's gonna take a while, so stay tuned. Okay, guys, so I'm back. I'm running CR Droid. So I'm gonna be showing you right away. CR Droid Android, let me dim the brightness a little bit just to show you. Okay, so we're, you're, we're running uh, CR Droid Android. Um, so, this is smooth and fast, but um, this is more kind of a stock lollipop ROM with a few customizable options available in CR Droid Custom, like uh, you can set up your clock style where you want it to be but you can for example add the seconds to the clock you can uh, you can't disable this there are not uh, these arrows there for connection uploading and uh, downloading a recent panel they are more of a stock one with minimalistic uh, clear all button there the lock screen has default options for middle screen shortcuts, bottom corner shortcuts display you can set up your LCD density animation is the same thing as uh, in any other lollipop ROM that I've uh, been uh, reviewing in the latest uh, 25, 24 hour Hours, okay, wake, 
block blocker you can add you can block your ads they're nothing different for from any other custom lollipop ROM so this is more of a stock lollipop ROM without any customization and uh, it is moving uh, fast without any any modifications okay so let's let's see the RAM stays at uh, stays at um, 1.2 free which is decent without any custom kernel this is running the stock kernel from Cyanogen mode as you may see this is also based on Cyanogen mode CM12 change log we have some informations here devices and maintainers I haven't seen anything related to to the update the over the year update I don't know if it benefit the OTA update but uh, yeah that was it for today I hope you like it if you did please thumbs up and subscribe to my channel I'm a little bit tired sorry for my voice and uh, see you soon guys bye bye